Hello everyone. Today I'm going to show how to automate Azure VM shutdown and start during off hours. The main advantage for these settings is to reduce the cost of your Azure subscription. First, here is my VM, and I wanted to uh, auto start and shut down and auto start this VM, this particular VM. So click on this VM. Then we go to the settings in automation click on tasks so in task we will create and add a task so here are auto al al already uh, four template in here so we will first click on power of virtual machine template and then we will create start virtual machine so first power of virtual machine click on here and here already the connection is there you can add new connection this connection is for for this one is you need to uh, use your as your admin admin account and for this you can use your uh, email account click on configure give a task name let's say vm off give a time let's say today as this is for a test purpose i configure the time on let's say 11 pm in in here is already 10:58 so configure on 11:01 pm time zone So select your time zone. For me, it is Bangladesh standard time. Interval select on one. Frequency for days, and for notify me, you can click on uh, yes, or you can turn it off. You uh, also uh, provide your email address in here. otherwise this template will not uh, create it review and create click on create so after two minutes my vm will shut down now this is for uh, shutdown now i wanted to auto turn on this vm auto start this vm so this will be the same click on configure click on VM give a name VM on start time for testing purpose I, I'm, I'm uh, giving the time in just after 10 minutes 11 10 p.m. Uh, you will uh, give the time of your require how 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 long you want to, to turn it off let's say you, you, you just uh, turn off your VM on uh, 10 p.m. on night and in the morning at 9 a.m. it will uh, turn on so it will just use 9 a.m. in here give your time zone interval click one frequently day notify your email address just type your email address in here review and create click on create so both of your task is already created now go to your VM in here it's already running uh, already what time is going on time is on to turn off our VM let's refresh this okay let's refresh couple of times it might take some time to shut down your VM So you can see here yeah, my VM is automatically stopped. So you can verify the settings by go to the task in here. In VMO, the click on run. 
see it is succeed so it already succeed uh, it takes a uh, 13 second to turn off your VM so it's already stop the VM now we will wait for uh, 10 minutes to see if my VM is turn on on 11 10 p.m. so I will pause the video in here and we will connect after uh, 7 or 8 minutes Uh, so the VM is still on the uh, stop stop phase so it's already uh, 10 11 10 <coughs> so let's see it uh, automatically start our VM or not so do some refresh in here might say take some times to start on the VM yeah see it's already running so to see that how much time it take to turn on the VM click on task now click on VM on schedule the run view see it succeed so it takes 11.92 uh, second to turn on the VM so that's how you can configure settings for automatically shut down and turn on your VM here it is an another option you can uh, try to turn off your VM it is an auto shutdown option in here so in auto shutdown it will uh, shut down your VM on a specific schedule time but it will not uh, it will uh, never you know turn on your VM so you can uh, enable these settings for auto shutdown and for turn on you can uh, create the turn on task in here or you can just use the task uh, option in here you don't need to use this option uh, so thank you